the all-new Mitsubishi Sports has just made its global debut at the Gekindo Indonesia International Auto Show 2023 in Jakarta. The production model stays close to the 2022 Mitsubishi XFC concept in terms of exterior and interior design, albeit with slightly toned-down features. Overall, the SUV looks modern and muscular thanks to the sculpted bodywork, the shape of the grille, and the aggressive LED lighting units on both ends. Design highlights include a floating roof, muscular fender flares, and the latest evolution of Mitsubishi's dynamic shield face. Both front and rear lighting feature T-shaped signatures to appear wider and more stable. The launch models get 18-inch alloys with relatively large 225 to 50 tires. Inside the Sforce, one encounters Mitsubishi's horizontal axis concept. For the first time in a Mitsubishi model, the instrument panel is adorned with a melange fabric, not only for its contemporary appeal, but also for its durability against stains. The dashboard features a 12.3-inch infotainment touchscreen and an 8-inch digital instrument cluster housed in the same panel. Another highlight is the Dynamic Sound Yamaha Premium Sound System, featuring no less than 8 speakers. Powering the Sforce is a 1.5-liter DOHC naturally aspirated four-cylinder engine, known as the 491, which has been previously employed in models like the Expander and Expander Cross. It producing 103 horsepower and 141 newton meters of torque. Power is exclusively transmitted to the front axle through a CVT gearbox. The Sforce features Mitsubishi's patented active yaw control that can adjust the driving force between the two front wheels and four drive modes of normal, wet, gravel, and mud. This SUV has two variants, namely Exceed, which is the entry-level variant, and Ultimate, which is the highest type. Starting price for the Ultimate CVT is $27,000 while for the Exceed CVT variant is $25,000 in Indonesia. The Sforce will go into production at the Mitsubishi Motors Kramayuda Indonesia and will be shipped to customers from November 2023.